Welcome back guys, it's the tight wad and today we are going to do a scientific experiment. As you can see, we have a double door stainless steel refrigerator and we have a dent, mysterious dent. We don't know how it got in our refrigerator, but we're gonna try something today or a few things possibly if the first one doesn't work to see if we can get this dent removed with some things that we have around the house. But you can see the dent right here in the middle of the screen. And we're gonna see what we can do to get it removed. So as most of you know, scientifically, heat makes things expand and cool makes things contract. So we're gonna use a hair dryer to heat the spot up. And then I'm going to blast it with just some compressed air upside down. Cause as we know, upside down, it creates a really cold frost. So they say you can use dry ice. Dry ice is not readily available, so we're gonna try this instead and see how it works. All right, so it's actually pretty hot right now, so I'm gonna go ahead and blast it with this and see what happens. I'm gonna get a towel and wipe it off. We'll see if we make any progress. You can see the dent is still there. Uh, that condensation is just from the dry ice making condensation on it so doesn't appear that it worked fully um, from my view the dent looks smaller but my eyes could be tricking me so i'm going to try to hit it with a little more dry ice it's really cold now so i'm going to heat it back up and then try it one more time maybe dry ice, or not dry ice, with compressed air a little bit longer and see what happens One more time. This time I'm gonna let it sit there and cool down on its own or warm up on its own. I can still tell the dent is there somewhat. So I don't think this experiment is going to work. So myth busted that on stainless steel, a hair dryer and upside down can of compressed air does not work. Well guys, I'm really bummed that this experiment didn't work. Uh, we really wanted that dent removed. So if you know of a way to remove the dent that doesn't include the compressed air or dry ice, please submit it in the comments section below. If you want to see a video showing some home hacks, uh, the top left video shows how to mark holes for items you want to hang that don't necessarily have level hooks on it. And then the video in the top right shows an easy way to drill holes in sheetrock without making a huge mess all over the place. Hope you guys have a great day.